Hey folks, today I wanted to show you how you can uh, control multiple instruments inside one contact instance uh, inside Bitwig. So you have one contact instance and there are multiple instruments inside um, and the first instrument is on MIDI channel 1 and the second is on MIDI channel 2 and you went to want to control each of them uh, from Bitwig, you need um, one instrument track and then you route this uh, MIDI information from this track into contact and you don't use the uh, tracks uh, output, you use uh, plugins here and use contact 5 and then you have a number here and you can select the MIDI channel with this number and if you want to control the first instrument, which is MIDI channel 1, you use 1. And when you want to control the second instrument, which is MIDI channel 2, you select of course 2. And uh, uh, on the contact track you can select multiple outputs, so you can use VST plugins or um, yeah, chain instruments, devices from Bitwig. And yeah, that's basically it. Uh, but for me, I don't use this feature. Um, I am use uh, one instance on each track because it's much faster. Um, when you have multiple instruments inside contact, like this here, I have two. And when you have six or seven, um, it becomes so, uh, so cluttered. You need to um, a map inside your brain all the time which channel goes to which uh, instrument and which instrument goes to which output chain here and you have to make so much thinking about routing um, for me it's much easier when you have one track there's one contact uh, on you open it up and you have that instrument and the chain is after that instrument so it's much easier I don't think there is a real benefit in using multiple libraries inside one instance, but maybe it fits your workflow better. Um, and that's it for now for this video. I wanted to show you the possibility of this kind of routing inside Bitwig. And yeah, hope to see you soon. Until next time, see you and bye.